Well, hello everyone. I hope you're all doing well. This is Dave. This is Talking Plastic, and I have some stuff to do this week. <laughs> all right. So right here, you can obviously see I got Frankenberry and Count Chocula. But uh, when, uh, by the time I got notified and got on there, and uh, Blueberry went, uh, Booberry went into a notification, so I'm waiting for it to be. I'm being notified so I can actually order the Booberry because I want the Booberry. So we got these two, and because I'm a big big huge Frankenberry fan uh, I did pick this up too this is the watch uh, it's only 2,000 of these being made I don't know if they're still available or not uh, but uh, it would have been nice if the if it actually worked I don't know if it's a wind-up type or if it has a battery in it <laughs> but I'm not gonna open it I'm gonna leave it closed uh, I bought it because it's it's Frankenberry. I got I love Frankenberry, man. That's my most valuable pop is the metallic. Oh, you guys can't see it, but it's the metallic Frankenberry. That's my most valuable pop. And then in, we'll finish off with. Can you guys guess what this is? Only only the metal pops come in boxes this big, the die cast. This is the Iron Man. So we'll take a look at Iron Man. I have not opened it yet, so I'm gonna open it up on film. So we'll do that one last. Let's take a real quick look at Count Chocula and Frankenberry cereal boxes. And you know what? Oh boy. <laughs> Where is it? Ah, you know what? There it is down here. I use this desk for, it's like a multi-purpose desk now. And um, and I keep moving this and uh, uh, long story. Anyway, so let's start with Count Chocula. And uh, let's take a look at him, man. Let's get him out of the box and take a look at him. I don't think these hold out. This box is kind of funky in the way it, yeah. It's formed a little funky. Um, and then it's kind of funky inside there. I don't know if you guys can see that. That's, that's kind of weird. Anyway, uh, I don't think the cereal boxes pops. That uh, I don't think they're as very, very popular. I don't think they, you guys like them? Let me know, man. I, I actually like them. And it looks like the milk is crooked. Man, Whew, got the milk in there. Push it back in there. It's really loose. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see that right there. Um, you know what? Let me do. Whoa, he's a little wobbly. So I can see a little bit better. Yeah, it looks like it. The back of it could have been. It's kind of shabby work there, man. I, I'm really disappointed with that. Uh, the way it's put together there. But the front. Love it. Uh, the milk, like I said, it's a little loose. I keep pushing it back in there. But there's Count Chocula. Uh, and he's got his, his milk for his bowl of cereal. Well, you gotta have that, you know, gotta have some milk. I, don't know, I guess there's some people out there to eat it dry. I never eat my cereals dry. I always had to have some milk. Okay, so there's Count Chocula. You guys will have to let me know, man. Why don't people like the, the cereal box uh, uh, pops? I, I actually like them. Okay, I have a couple of them. I don't remember which ones. I know I got Lucky Charms and some other ones around here. I don't remember where. Got too many pops in here anyway. And uh, I don't know if, if you guys have been following the channel or not. It's it's getting very slim pickings for me as far as pops go and uh, sodas and stuff like that. Uh, so my, chan my, my amount of videos is probably going to decrease here in, in a real not distant future. Man, these things are really in there. Funky. Now this one's made better in the back. It's a lot better. It's a lot straighter. You don't see glue. Almost like see glue on this one. It's like it's melted. Um, this one's actually a lot better, which I'm happy because you know me, I, I like this one better. It's got a nice scratch on the front there though, but no big deal. It's Frank and Barry, man. Frank and Barry. Which ones you guys like the best? Frank and Barry, Boo Barry, Count Chalky. You gotta let me know, man. Let me know. Uh, I, obviously, you already know. Frankenberry, Frankenberry, Frankenberry. Now I'm gonna do is, like I said, I showed you this, guys. Um, I'll try to do a picture of it. Now maybe I'll, uh, if I can get it in a split screen somehow. I don't know how this is gonna photograph uh, through plastic, but I really don't want to open it. I'm gonna just leave it. I didn't buy the other two. Uh, if they're available, I I may still pick them up uh, when I've ordered the Booberry cereal box if they ever gets in stock. Uh, just to have the complete collection. Uh, I'm, I'm still not 100% sure if I'm gonna do that or not yet. Uh, did you guys get any of the watches? What do you think? Are you wearing them? <laughs> I see me going to work with a, a Frankenberry watch on. Yeah, they'll be like, 
excuse me? What are you wearing? Frankenberry! I don't think they'll be too keen on that one. Alright, so let's move Frankenberry and Count Chocolate way over here to the left. And let's take a look at this one I'm extremely excited about. Um, yeah, uh, I'm a, I, I, I need the Batman though. I, I will be getting the Batman. I just I wasn't fortunate enough to get it when it came out. But I think I'm going to go ahead and start collecting these. And no, these won't be going on the shelves because my shelves are not designed to hold this kind of weight. And for those who have not seen one of these yet, they come completely protected. This is one of the things I love about these die cast uh, pops. They're well protected, man. Very well protected. All right. Let me get it out of there. And then again, you can see, you know, it feels like you might be loose in there. I'm not sure. And uh, then it's wrapped because it's, again, protected. Let me get it out of there. And, I, and for those that haven't picked one of these up yet, they, they, they're a little hefty, man. They got a little weight to them. Uh, I think in my video when I did this one, I actually weighed it, if I remember correctly. I'm not 100% positive. I'm pretty sure I did. Okay, let's take this thing out. Get it out of there. Try not to tear it all up, but I'm going to have to to get it out of there. Okay. Now, I, I know the big thing is for a lot of people is the, the price of these. Yeah, and it is. It's These are definitely not cheap, man. Um, for a pop. Uh, when you can buy several regular pops for the price of this one. Um, the one thing I would love to know is, you know what? No sticker? I thought this would have a sticker on it. Letting you know that it was a Funko Shop. Exclusive. Interesting. No sticker. Okay. All right, and then, uh, oh, well, I guess you guys could have seen that. This is there to protect that. Again, this is for those that haven't seen one of these in real life and, or have seen any videos on these yet. And it comes in a box that's completely lined with foam. I'm going to throw that back in there because I'm not going to put it back in. It's going to go right next to my Captain America. Okay, and then, like you said, it's completely surrounded by foam. I think he's loose. That's exactly what happened to him. Uh, yeah, he's loose. And I think that's why they did that, because they found that these things have a tendency to... It's only a little tiny clip here that holds it on. You just push that down and it pops off. And uh, so, yeah, they have a tendency to move around. Because, like I said, again, these they got some weight to them, man. And, uh, yeah, that's that looks really, really cool. Let me go over with the glasses. Got to look at it really in detail here. Okay. Awesome, man. You guys should be seeing it spinning right there next to me as I'm checking this out. I'm holding it because I'm afraid it might slide off the off the base. Man, that looks really, really cool. And I, like I said before, and my, my son was in that video, I think with this one, is we talked about, you know, the only downside of these is, I mean, at first glance, you really can't tell they're any different than any other pop, which is their Funko Pops, but uh, most people wouldn't even tell the difference. The only Real collectors would know right off the bat. Well, this all gives it away, I guess, too, at the same time. So there you go, man. That is, yeah, you know, that is really awesome. So now I got the two. I just need Batman. What do you guys think the next one will be? Uh, I, I just, I have no idea. I, I, I really don't. I have no clue what the next to pop would be. I can't wait, and they better do it. It's a Pennywise, man. I need a, a metallic, I mean, a die-cast Pennywise, man. Hint, hint, Funko. Pennywise. <laughs> All right, guys. I guess I'll end it there, man. I rambled enough, man. You have to let me know, man, what do you guys think of the, the die-cast. Again, I know I've asked before, but um, what do you guys think? I know the price is a little steep. Why doesn't anybody like the, why do most people don't like the cereal box pops? Uh, again, I do. Uh, let me know. All right, uh, and if you got these, let me know. What do you think? Anybody wearing them? <laughs> All right, again, I'll ramble, man. I'll end it there, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. And yes, I think there will be a video next week. I have my uh, my sodas coming, man. I'm, I'm, I can't wait for them to get here. I'm hoping they get here early enough to, so I can do a video next week. So, All right, guys, till then, see ya. Have a great weekend, week, whatever it is when you're watching this, man, and, and stay safe, guys. Thanks so much.